tougher line and its importance in the spinal anesthesia, let's start our presentation. The tougher line, it is also called Jacobi's line, is an important anatomical landmark used to safely perform spinal anesthesia. Here's a step-by-step -step explanation of what the Tuffier's line is and how it's used. Definition of Tuffier's line. It is an imaginary horizontal line drawn between the highest points of the iliac crests. This line usually intersects the L4 vertebral body or the L4-L5 inner space. Now the importance of Tuffier's line. Spinal anesthesia must be administered below the conus medullaris, which ends around L1 or L2 in adults to avoid damaging the spinal cord. The space between L3 and L4 or the space between L4 and L5 are commonly targeted. Tuffier's line helps. Locate these safe interspaces without the need for imaging. Now the step-by-step -step approach to locate tuffier line. Two positions are commonly used. The first one is sitting position and the second one is lateral position. In sitting position, we ask the patient to sit and bend forward like hugging a pillow. But in lateral position, patient lies on their side with knees pulled toward the chest fetal position. After positioning the patient, we will use both hands to palpate the highest points of the iliac crests on both sides of the pelvis and will dot draw the imaginary line. Mentally or with a skin marker, draw a horizontal line connecting the top of each iliac crest across the back. And finally, we will identify the vertebral level dot this line typically crosses the spine at the L4 spinous process, or L4 and L5 inner space. These are all about tougher line and its importance in spinal anesthesia. Thanks for watching.